Hi guys, this is going to be a Dollar Tree um, new item video and it is, I don't know, at least two Dollar Trees uh, stuff that I found. I thought these little projectors were really cute. They had a couple of different ones and these nasal washes are, uh, I think, a really good deal. I saw them at one location and then another location had just the refills for it. So keep an eye out for those. That's a great deal. They're having more Yardly stuff, more different bars of soap, some different eyeglass cases and eyeglass straps than what they usually have. These are magnet toys. I guess you push them around, you know, the uh, repelling magnets, which I think is pretty cool. That would be good for um, Easter baskets, I think. Parchment pop-up sheets, just like the foil ones that they have. Then they have parchment squares. These water bottles, I think they're the same as what they have um, at like Target and stuff. I don't know, they look the same to me, but these are $1.25. And they have some smaller ones and then the larger ones with just different characters and movies and stuff. A lot of different glassware and shot glasses. Quite a variety of that stuff. And then the Prime Energy Drinks. I don't drink energy drinks. Or maybe this is not an energy drink. I don't know. I don't drink them. So, um, but Prime, I think, is generally more expensive. They have AirTag keychains. They even have iPhone um, phone cases. I thought these cat toys were really cute. They're like Taco Bell sauce packets and uh, sushi. Very cute. This is a new item that I hadn't seen. It's a seat organizer. I mean, it's small, but $1.25. There's a couple of different wax melts. I thought this mermaid stickers were cute. A poker set I've never seen before. They always have playing cards at the Dollar Tree. There's a lot of new crafting stuff. They have these puffy stickers and mirrored stickers, just a lot. Make sure you look through the, if you're like a scrapbooker or you use stickers for things, make sure you look through the sticker section because it's a lot of stuff. A huge variety at the different stores. Iron on patches. Quite a few different types. Some of them had sequins on it. This, this was pretty much all the same there. Iron on stickers. Yes, <laughs> paper crimper. I, I've never seen it before, but it's broken. It was the only one they had. <laughs> I finally found these solar lights. I got five of them. I can't wait to, to use them. These peeps, I hadn't seen the peep line. These iridescent bottles are really pretty. So they had, this was in the little round thing. They had the woven baskets, which I hadn't seen. The three packs of um, the butterfly candles. The stain remover wipes I've seen on some other videos. I haven't tried them yet. I did buy a box. The energy drinks. Those straws are $1.98. I don't know. I didn't scan them to see how much they were. But they have Chupa Chupa lip balms, which I think is fun. There was a couple of different flavors. There's a lot of different lip balms lately at the Dollar Tree. Make sure you check out the, uh, the registers too because there's a lot there. Play-Doh Putty. I got a couple of these. I haven't opened them yet. I'm going to give one of them to my daughter for Easter. Um, but I think it might be like Silly Putty Play-Doh because it says it never dries out. So if you've tried that, leave a comment below. They had four different colors, I think. And I got two of them. If you're enjoying this video, don't forget to subscribe and like. Your support really means a lot. So these things are called squeezlings, but it was hard. I don't understand. I should have bought one because my oldest daughter likes Peppa Pig, but yeah, it was like hard. I don't know if it's enclosed in something else or what. So this Dollar Tree is a plus Dollar Tree. So they have some more expensive shoes. There's a different wax melt. I mean, it smelled fine. I don't really want candy flavored wax melts though. I bought these clay t clay tools. They have a lot of different craft crafting kits. Um, we've seen these diamond ones before. Um, I've never used those, but 
I was so excited when I saw that they have, um, like embroidery kits and then the felting kits and stuff like that. This is new cardstock that's decorative. They only had the one, one color set though. I, I've seen other color sets on other videos. Scented Crayola dough. These are cute. They come with the markers inside and you can, you know, kids can color them, which is fun. These little activity tins, super cute. And these are little activity kits. All these are all $1.25. The spoon rest, very useful. You can use it for makeup brushes too. A share body spray. There's more Yardley stuff, like I said. They actually have Soft Soap brand instead of the Spa Soap generic. And then Dial hand soap as well. These are fashion gems. I guess they stick on stuff? I don't know. There was a few different varieties, but you can stick them on. They have gummy bear um, bobby pins, which I think is really cute for $1.25. Gave me Betsy Johnson vibes. Mentos gum. I don't chew gum because I have TMJ, but those are $1.25 as well. I'm not sure if that's a good deal. You guys can let me know in the comments if you chew gum and think that's a good deal. And they had the sweet shop, um, different things. A lot of Firefly toothbrushes were at this location, um, which is a great deal for $1.25. And then the, the toothbrush kits, just a lot of um, good kids toothbrushes. I have a sensitive mouth and I have to use the soft like extra soft toothbrushes and it's the guru brand or whatever it's called that's what I get and I buy a few at a time because extra soft is hard to find as far as toothbrushes go there's another chupa chupa lip balm now I want to address the fact that Dollar Tree is their closing stores which I mentioned on one of my past videos like within the last few weeks and but the stores they're closing are more of the um dollar family dollar ones rather than dollar trees but they're actually talking about increasing the price point in their dollar tree stores up to seven dollars now i've seen this happen i've seen it on some videos on youtube and they haven't i haven't been into a dollar tree that the change has been made yet so i've seen it on tv but i haven't seen it personally and I'm curious if you guys, your Dollar Trees, have they changed over? Do you have a lot of Dollar Trees in your area? Because I have a lot of Dollar Trees in my area and I don't go to them all constantly. But like I said, I haven't seen a change at any of the Dollar Trees that I go to, that I've been to within the last few weeks. So I saw what would be a Dollar Tree Plus. I guess it was a regular Dollar Tree turned into a Dollar Tree Plus, but then they have stuff up to $7 as well. And it's mixed throughout the store. So they have um, the prices on the shelves, usually wherever the item's displayed. Now this, I didn't know the sponge was such a big deal. I, I, I don't know, but apparently it's a big deal. It was the only time I saw that. I wish I had bought it. But that container that I have is a travel container and it's for liquids. It's for little wedges and I'm get I got that for when I travel for work so this store had a huge amount of tasty cakes and and Twinkies and Hostess stuff and things like that which I you know love I love the pies cherry pies and lemon pies are my favorite so if you've if you haven't seen the drinks in the snack zone they've increased the prices um in all the stores that have snack zones as far as I know but they do have the prices marked on the refrigerator and I don't know I think these scissors are a little different I don't remember them having that little hook thing on them in the past um, let me know if the comments if I'm wrong and they have quite a view comment they always have a variety of comment and some nice dishes you guys don't know the cinnamon that was sold at the Dollar Tree was recalled because of lead and we had just recently bought some so that was I'm glad that they advertised it and publicized it because I, I mean we we got rid of ours but I just wanted to you know show on the video that it's been recalled so if you have the Dollar Tree cinnamon you know throw it away it's dangerous and they have spackle 
I, I, I don't know. I thought it was plumber's putty, but it's spackle. I don't know if that's a good deal. Pink and blue extension cords. I always buy my light bulbs at the Dollar Tree because, I mean, they're such a great deal and they work just the same as any other LED light bulb. So, a lot of fun night lights. A lot of miniatures of different characters, which is fun. <laughs> Skull goo. <laughs> So I'm thinking that maybe the Dollar Tree that I have near me, it's a Dollar Tree Plus. They put a, they put price scanners in it. And I'm thinking that maybe they're going to turn that one into one of the ones that increase, they increase up to the $7. But I feel like it's been a couple months. It's been at least one month, but maybe two that I saw the scanner in there and they still haven't changed it. So... Now these tins, there's a big variety of these tins and there's Peppa Pig ones and I'm trying to find them for my oldest daughter. And because how useful, I mean, they're just metal tins, but I think they're very useful. But this store only had Jasmine and Ariel, but there's a big variety. They have Avengers and princesses and Peppa Pig and I don't know, just different things. So I'm not impressed with the Harry Potter wall decals, but I really loved these moth and butterfly decals. They might just be moths, but they're really pretty. They have some on both sides. Unfortunately, most of my walls in my house are that popcorn texture, you know, the lumpy texture walls because it's old and I can't put stickers on my walls. So that bums me out. Those are wall decals too. They're like puffy stickers. I've seen um, a lot of iridescent things, not a lot of iridescent things, but quite a few. The summer line has started to show up um, around. It's not a huge, huge amount yet. These little woven baskets are really cute and they have a huge variety of them. So I found velour fabric pieces which is awesome because all I ever see is just like the designed fabric, which is there's nothing wrong with that. But I think having a different variety and different type, um, macrame cord in different colors. A lot of different yarns. I like the fact that they have just cotton rather than the acrylic. So then here are these, um, they come with the hoop and the thread and um, the, the cross stitch fabric is printed on. So I think that makes it easy. It's a great starter. I got the eye one because I like the evil eye. Um, it's a great starter for anyone who has an embroidered or, you know, a, a novice at embroidering because you can just follow the picture. So I thought that was nice because they have other kits that don't have the hoop in them it still comes with the thread but these 3d shapes they had a butterfly a heart and then also a star they're just really upping their craft item game like that you can you know make stuff out of paint you know combine them to be different you know to make a larger thing there's a mermaid. I got a feather because I'm going to try and make like a quill out of it or something. Dragonflies. There's the star. I like to put magnets on the metal things and hang pictures. <laughs> hang pictures at work. Here's the felting kit. That I got the peach one because, you know, it's it's adorable. But they have a few different ones. And I've, I've been wanting to try felting for a few years, but... Um, I don't know. I just haven't, but it comes with the foam and everything like it comes with everything in it. So, and they have new like crochet kits and there's more embroidery kits. I don't know. Just really, really fun crafting stuff for $1.25. I don't think you can beat that in my opinion. I worry that, um, some of the stuff that we're used to seeing for $1.25 is going to go up in price. But we won't really know until 
until the prices change. These, I don't remember ever seeing these at the Dollar Tree. The noodle extender. You can connect uh, full noodles together, which is cool. A variety of color of elastic cord. Or elastic band, I guess it's not considered a cord. Lots of felt. And then they had this little, like, fur like plushy kind of fabric you can make stuffed animals out of it how cute i've never seen that before the burlap we've seen um plain fabric see teddy bear vibes right it's so cute crochet needles um i've shown these before they have the slides um a dollar 25 i mean that's such a great deal and they're really lightweight the macrame plant hangers Plenty of artificial flowers for pretty much everything. They have their um, yard tools that, you know, you buy the handle and then the different ends to it. Tote bags for the beach or, you know, pool or something like that. Now these birds are so pretty. So here's more of the, um, the summer line, but only just the candles. None of the other stuff yet so far but these birds were in like five different colors I think they're like a pearl or iridescent -y color and then these bottles were really pretty you could put like a salt or sugar scrub in it like for the bathroom there was three different colors like two-tone so pretty this must be, it must have been three Dollar Trees that I went to, because I'm trying, I think that this was at a third Dollar Tree. I have some teacher gifts already. It's kind of early for the end of the school year, but I don't know if you'll find it when it gets closer to the school year ending. Any more Prime drinks? A lot of different Mike and Ikes, like a huge variety of them. I didn't even know they had packs of just red. Those are cute. They have a glue gun pad, which I haven't seen before. I mean, technically you can use like any silicone mat for that, but that's new. 